Alright. Filming Fatty's Halloween house. Take one. We got the lights on. I already shot a clip in night shot. I'm not sure how good that did. So I'm just gonna go around and show everything. And we'll work from left to right. We got a lot of props. We'll get to the good stuff. Uh oh. Room in a dustpan. And while I'm down here, there's our compressor. Fatty's getting ready to hook up our cobweb gun. And we blow cobwebs all over the place. We'll get a shot of that when we're done. This is our wall of torture. If any of you guys ever looked at the journal, actually you can still look at the journal in the archive section. You'll see we got a lot of pictures of our Halloween stuff. We do it up. Actually, it's Fatty's gig. I just help him out a little bit. I don't have the money to buy this shit. <laughs> Fatty just spit out his coffee. Little flaming, what is that called, Rob? A cauldron? Yeah, a little flaming cauldron. There's our man in the rack. You can see some of the cobwebs hanging on some of the stuff from last year. We'll get it all cobwebbed up nice. This is my pride and joy, one of them. This is a Jason part four final chapter replica. Fatty, when you get a second, pull up his mask. I want to get a shot of his face. Got a nice machete. Hang on, let me get his face real good. There we go. Let's get a face of that. Yeah. Part four, final chapter. Lift it up a little higher. There's his little axe wound. Big axe wound. Okay. He's not full size, as you can see. Rob can kick his ass pretty good. He's ended up a little short. But he's neat. Yeah, we're still putting a place together. Here's our little bar. Get some stools out in front of that. We got Otis from House of a Thousand Corpses up there, but we lost his hair. He looked pretty good without his hair, though. We got a big bat. He looks good in the dark. His eyes blink. Little red eyes. I'm standing under a bat. This is a cool bat. We're getting lined up. This is a Bigfoot prop. You know, I like my Sasquatch. This came out of a movie. I think it was Sasquatch Mountain or something. It's actually a movie prop. I was able to pick it up. And then there's a replica of Jason Takes Manhattan. I'll get Fatty to pull up the mask on that. There's our glowing skull. If you touch it, woo, it's probably not showing up, but if you touch it, little bolts go into your fingers and 
follow it around. There's Jason Goes to Hell. And we got a skull with a whole bunch of fiber optics in it. Another skull. Got some glowing cockroaches. There's a skull. Fiber optics in that too. There's our killer clown. Whoa. Watch a zoom. He's kind of wicked looking. Clowns are freaky. Then we got Evil Ernie. This will be where we put our cups and stuff. Salsa. I'm not sure if you can hear that noise or not, but that's her. Him, her, spinning. There's our gargoyle. Little Michael Myers. He actually makes a noise if you hit him. Let's see if we can get him to do it. There we go. This is a cool skull. Chrome. Glowing fingertips. Glowing cockroaches. Pirate skull. He glows too. Alright. Now. That's a Jason mask. Where he wore his sack. Part 2 and 3. He's pretty wicked underneath of that sack, too. See his eyeball. Jason Tombstone. Black cat glowing eyes. Glowing a dark demon. You can see the remnants of a lot of the uh, spot, the cobwebs that we blew last year. We left it up. It really looks good and to the, over the bar is really nice with glowing the dark stuff. Freddy Krueger's tombstone. Hey, can you uh, lift the mask on Jason Takes Manhattan, please? Mike Myers. Gotta have Mikey. Yeah, he's wicked. There's Jason Takes Manhattan. Remember down in the sewer at the end? I'm probably the only person to watch that movie. But that's him. Cool. More glow in the dark stuff. There's another Jason. Part four. Big evil clown prop. Hey, my shoulder's hurting. Jason goes to hell prop. Man, I'm going to have a heck of a time putting all the key words in on this one. It's going to have a million tags. Bloody Mary's bar. All glow in the dark. We're going to have a DJ and karaoke. Another Michael Myers prop. 